Welcome back to SnowRunner, my favourite little ragamuffins that still watch me. If you don't, where have you been? I need answers. I have missed you very dearly. However, today, as you can see, I am in a little shed. It is the little starter pickup truck. Now, I'm going to be real with you. I'm English, and I still think pickup trucks have a certain arousal of appeal to them. However... Thanks to Mr. Watt Limes, we have been given that. It is a pickup truck for men. Yes, it is not a wimpy ass Ford or a utterly pasta ridden, limp wristed Chevy. It's a Ram. It is a Ram. We've got a Ram. And as always, this is done by the wonderful Mr. Watt Limes, who, let's just say, makes some of the most OP but funnest mods in this game. So go and show him some much-deserved love. Otherwise, I will come and get you in your sleep. So, let's see what we have got to put on this bad boy stock. We've got bulletproof, way too much power, and no one should ever need this, so I'm just going to leave it here. We need it. Gearbox, let's, uh, hmm, I'm going to stick to default, but I am going to stick on the toe suspension, because the toe, I, I need the toe for something which you might not expect. So let's stick on the toe suspension. Now we have got a smattering of tyres. So we've got regulars and OPs. Now I kind of like the look of these stock OPs. So I'm going to put that on as the huge amount of list goes up. So then we've got the toe shot. That's meh. But this is where the fun starts. So we have got a drop hitch. Yes. Rock lights. Oh yes. Roof. Light bar. Yes please. Front bumper. Weighted, uh, yeah, all right. The bed now we can have a toy up UTV rack or the light bar. Now, this is a shame because I really like that light bar, it looks dope, it's how I would have it. But just to tease you, I'm gonna put that on it. Reasons will become clear. Uh, let's see, we've got black rims, yeah, I'm gonna keep them. Let's, we've got a smattering of colours all the way down. This is quite the assortment of colours, if I'm honest. But it can't be a dodge. And it can't and it can't not be red. It has to be red. And this is the almighty Zeus. So let's see if we Oh the suspension does quite a lot. Mamma Cita, it does quite a lot, so I'm going to leave it there. Uh, oh, it sounds dirty. Now, I don't know about you, but this sort of reminds me of the James May and Jeremy Clarkson Toyota Hilux in this colour with the big tyres. I don't know why. So, right away you can see it's a fast boy with very stiff suspension, but... That is because it needs to be. Now, with this being a Watt Limes mod, I'm not gonna I'm not gonna be gentle with it. I'm gonna show you just how much abuse this thing can take. I'm gonna drive through the river like it's not even here. Like the goddamn beast that this thing is. Yes, I'm underwater, but still going strong. Now I am going to lower my delicious little ram bottom off the edge of this bridge because I want it to be able to... Oh, well that won't be... Uh, that won't be level. I want to load some fun onto this thing. So let's grind it up against there and yeah, let's park it up there. Now this comes for part two of our mod. Hopefully this doesn't float away. So part two of this is this. The Limes X 
SX, I can't, I can't say it. It's a buggy. It's a little Can-Am buggy. So let's see what we've got. We have got a Diesel Addict 66 spec. Way too much power. No, yeah, of course, we're going to do the way too much power. We've got already got an overpowered truck. Why aren't we going to have an overpowered buggy? Let's have the fast gearbox suspension. Let's have short lift. That doesn't look like a short lift. Uh, oh, my God. We have got full-on moto tyres. Oh, my God. Days. Uh, I really, really like the look of, of those. But. I want those. Yell at me in the comments. I don't care. It, it's a it's a mini tractor. So front windshield. Yes, we'll have rock lights. Let's have regular lights. Light bar, of course, we need it. And rims are rims. Now let's spray paint it red to match the truck because we're gonna have a matching set and there's no interior. So let's see straight away, like, oh, no, none of this is animated. And it sounds, oh, it sounds meaty. Now, bear in mind, this is only third gear out of nine. I dread to think how fast it is. Oh! Turns out it's that fast. Okay, well, let's load this death trap up and see how Zeus Almighty can do. Well, I do this first time. Oh my God, I've done it first time. Now, the question is, will it pack? I really hope it will pack. Yes, it's got the ugly little wheel things, but it, it looks odd. But... Oh yeah! Let's go on a little off-roading trip, buddy! And this is why you have the towing suspension. So that you can do dumb shit like this. Is it just me or does that thing look like it's sliding off? Oh! And I also think I should unpack the... Oh, no! No, 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 no! Balls! So let's see if I can climb onto. I, I want to see if I can mount myself. No, I can't. So, I did plan for this. Through the power of editing, you shall see my solution. Yeah, that looks like a decent trailer. Oh, wait, 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 wait. This means I could actually fit my thingy. Detach that. Hold on. I've got an idea. Got an idea. Oh, yeah, that looks so much better. I'm getting a new one. Because turns out I suck at doing trailers. Right, so off we go. Don't worry about it. Wait, 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 wait. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. Okay, it's got Tomcat as the horn. 10 out of 10, would recommend. Hello there, bud. I have a trailer for you now so that you can kill your occupants in many, many interesting ways that don't include me. Oh, God, I've got to turn around. Well, that isn't precarious. Oh my god, will you stop being such a little bitch? Uh, I swear. Climb the goddamn thing! Oh, you're gonna be a bitch all the way, aren't you? Yeah! We're going on a trip in my favourite little zoo ship. So... As you can see, this thing has got tremendous pace through the water. It might as well be a boat. But you're thinking, hmm, how will it do through mud? As you can tell, with a trailer and another vehicle loaded up, it, it doesn't matter. You know, you stick the OP tyres on, you're fine. You are, 
you're trucking along like no problem has ever befalled it whatsoever actually the trailer is dragging more than this hold on i shall engage high suspension mode yeah like that did anything And as you can see, uh, my buggy is completely underwater, but it did it without a care in the world. Look at it go. It's an utter machine. What a good machine you are. Actually, hold on. I very rarely take this back route because it is known as Swamp Valley. But I want to see how well it does. Oh, there's my little parrot, like, having a whale of a time. Hold on, does it have a moving dash? No, it doesn't. That's disappointing. But, in the words of Tom Cat... Don't worry about it. Oh. It, it is ploughing through a mud like it's a goddamn boat. Look at it go! The gearbox is a bit iffy, but that's because it's the tow box, I think. Mind you, what tow box did I put on it? I can't even remember. Ooh! Now, bear this in mind, it's doing all this with another vehicle and trailer. It is not doing this on its own, it is doing it with weight. at this monster oh, oh that's a bit my buggy right now this actually gives me a good little play in the mud now as you can see this buggy is even more OP than the sodding truck so everything you've seen from the truck the buggy can do just faster with more tendencies to kill you now, don't be a bitch. I said, don't be a... I said, don't be a... Clyde the fuck! Thank you. I really am stupid sometimes. I should not be allowed near vehicles. Anyway, moving on. Oh! I just went airborne. Come on, we're almost at the top now. Right, this is where things are going to get dicey. Because I am going to detach that trailer. And I'm going to send... Well, that's convenient for unloading. I'm going to send them down one at a time to see what they can do. So, tally your hoses! Don't worry about it. Oh god! Can I pull myself out? The truck is now part of the mountain! Oh, there we go, I fell, I've fallen over. And it can go back on its own. And, I might say, with the mud, it looks even cooler. Anyway, so let's put this up to watch its little death trap brother do the jump. And see what it can do. Wait a minute. Did I not? I didn't unpack the truck. This is totally not a second one. Because I forgot to unpack the truck. And I can't be arsed going all the way up the hill. To get it. Ah! Okay, can I just say how pretty that sun looks? And we are back and there is totally not the trailer with the car that I totally forgot to unpack and not do anything with. So, let's see what this death trap can do. Whoa! It's now part of the forest. Well, you can fucking stay there. I, I hate that buggy with a passion. This thing though, the Zeus, is OP, it's badass as hell, and if you doubt this truck's qualifications, 
for being a badass. Uh, it was already raised, forget me. I'm going to show you this. This is the river. Okay. Not where trucks should go. I'm going to show you now. I'm going to drive to that bridge all the way on the other side. Through the river. Not care in the world. Yeah, it's getting deep. It's still going. It's still going. It's still going. The water's up to the windshield. And up and out. That is why this thing is called the Zeus, because it is a god amongst trucks. But anyway, if you like this video and any others that I've done, give it a little like, subscribe if you're new, and comment down below which is your favourite, the Death Trap Buggy or this Ram wannabe Zeus. Anyway, in the words of Songcat, don't worry about it. And I'll see you all next time. Try and get him to see this video. Whoever actually makes him see this video, I don't know. You'll win something. I don't know. Anyway, peace.